Hey guys, this is Nempo from Sheep Geeks. In this uh, back to basics video, I want to go through the essence of mana management. Uh, specifically the five second rule. Now what is the five second rule? Your mana regeneration uh, will not be at its fullest until you stop casting for five seconds. So whenever you spend mana on any spell, your regeneration gets halted. So during this time, any regeneration based on spirit does not happen, unless you have talents like priest's uh, meditation. So every second after the five second rule, your regeneration is very valuable. A big part of this rule is pre-casting because you can still line up and queue up heals and you can cancel them if it's unnecessary to follow through. So this is why we call it pre-casting. The reason why that is, is because a spell will only cost mana if you finish the cast. This is why it's very important to avoid casting unless it's absolutely necessary. And this is the reason why a lot of healers struggle with mana because they're throwing out heals when it's definitely not necessary. They're wasting mana on overhealing, not anticipating when the tank is going to get damaged. But let's just talk about MP5 and Spirit. Now, Spirit, it increases your regeneration, right? But it's the out of combat regeneration. But Spirit is only desirable for certain classes. MP5 or mana per five seconds, that one works constantly, even if you're casting. Um, so MP5 is good for all healers, but especially for those without talents that convert Spirit to MP5. But usually caster DPS is very unlikely to get any benefit from Spirit uh, because they're always finishing their casts uh, like a mage or elemental chamois. They always want to finish their cast. They're doing damage all the time. Let's just take a look at the stat priorities for the healing classes. Okay, so it's very important to note that most of these stat priorities may change from phase to phase. Because like spell haste can be more important for rest of shamis in tire six, for instance. So and, and for priests as well. But it's very hard to get spell haste gear right now uh, during this phase one. Holy Pallias and Rest of Shamis, they definitely want to focus on MP5. Whereas priests and druids, they prefer spirit over MP5. Big part of the mana resource management is just using this five second rule, pre-casting. Um, also, we covered down ranking before in previous videos, but down ranking can help you tremendously in saving mana and using cooldowns, uh, using mana potions. And a big part of mana potions is that you shouldn't be waiting until one minute, two minutes into the fight before using your mana potion. It should be triggered as soon as possible. So you can pop maybe four or five potions during one really long fight. Okay, so you should practice on pre-casting. Load up a spell, use your movement to, to stop the cast from finishing, and just try to anticipate when the tank or the group is going to take damage. If you can combine the five second rule with pre-casting, down ranking, cooldowns, and mana potions, you'll be a master healer in no time. It really works wonders. I've seen healers at the end of fights with 80, 90, 100% mana at the end because their mana management is so good. Okay, this was just a short video to, to let you guys know about the five second rule. Uh, check out our links in the description and don't forget to join the herd. Click those buttons below. Give us your thoughts in the comment section.